All right, what are the ideas? Uh, so it's a one Okay, okay, okay. All right, quiet, hey, hey, quiet down, quiet down. Hey, 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 one at a time, one at a time. Hey, one at a time, one at a time. Ryan, what's your idea? Uh, we could do whale watching. That's so stupid. There aren't whales in Texas. Samir. We can do a puppet show. Okay. Gabe. We can roast marshmallows in the heater. That's the stupidest idea ever. That's never gonna happen. Sorry I'm late, guys. I'm just so excited to do the show. How's it going? Ah! Why did you agree to this? Whoa, 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 guys. There's no need to be heated, okay? This is going to be difficult and it's going to be rough, but we have this because we are Fuse One and we are united. I mean, it looks like we have some great ideas. Yeah, no, it looks awesome. So when do we start? Right now. Meanwhile... <laughs> Meanwhile... I'm Maya. And I'm Amy. And, and you're, you're watching, watching WUTRP. What music are you listening to? I'm not really listening to anything. What song are you listening to? I'm watching a TikTok. Nice. <laughs> what song are you listening to? Uh, Sweater Weather by the Neighborhood. Slay! Okay, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> um, wait, what am I listening to? Oh, video games, Alana Del Rey. Nice, great song. It's called Sunday by What song are you listening to? Oh, uh, Happy or Brett Etchering. Nice, thank you. <laughs> what song are you listening to? <laughs> <laughs> Six and a half hours later. Perkins, in ten seconds or less, what is the eleventh letter of the alphabet? Uh, I'm gonna go with T. 
I have no clue if that's correct or not. I didn't think about that. You have the... So you're incorrect. It's T. No, it's it's K. Oh, it's K. Yes. <laughs> you, you, just yeah, said you said yeah. Same thing. <laughs> How many planets are there in our solar system? I know Pluto's not there anymore. Is it twelve? Final answer. Yep. That is incorrect. I know. Seven. <laughs> oh, Nerov. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, I get it. Nerov, what is heavier? A thousand pounds of feathers or a thousand pounds of bricks? They're, they're, they weigh the same. Is your name Nerov? Yes, it is. Okay. I don't know why I asked you. You're a swimmer. Can you list five countries that start with the letter A? Africa. <laughs> Albania. Algeria. Afghanistan. Afghanistan. Iraq. Iraq. <laughs> okay, ready? <laughs> you know. We're no strangers to love, Chad. You know the rules, Emily, and so do I. A full commitment's what I'm thinking of. You wouldn't get this from any other guy. I just want to tell you how I'm feeling. I just gotta make you understand. Not a slay moment. <laughs> not a slay moment. moment. That is not a slay moment. Never gonna give you up. Never gonna let you down. Never gonna run around and desert you. Never gonna make you cry. Never gonna say goodbye. Never gonna tell a lie and hurt you. We've known each other for so long. My heart's been aching, but. You're too shy to say it Inside we both know what's been going on We know the game and we're gonna play it Hi, I'm Grace, and if you're wondering why I wasn't in the end of the last few show, it's because they filmed without me. We're gonna be doing the seven second challenge, which is where I give you random tasks and students around try to complete them in under seven seconds. Let's get into it. So excuse us all that. Name all the oceans. Tell me the true meaning of Christmas. You mean your other shoe? Oh, both of them? Two, one. Pacific, Atlantic. Antarctic, uh... Your time is up, you failed. Oh, seven seconds? Yep. No, you got it. Good job. Oh! Yes. Good job, guys. Great, seven! The true meaning of Christmas is not presents. The true meaning is, uh, 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 Santa stalking your children. Give the applause for a short film. I love you. Talk about Cheeto Puffs about saying killer words. Someone dies. Cheeto Puffs are amazing. They taste great. Eat them. Yeah, yeah. yeah. They're better than the normal. Hey man, you corn you watching your call right? Sing the first song that comes to mind. Tell me about that story you have in your head. Dear when you smiled at me, I heard a melody. It haunted me from the start. Time. I accidentally puked on my uh dinner plate and I had to wash it and wash it. Something inside of me. Come to 10 in a separate language. Recite a poem about a disappointing ice cream. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, ready? Go. One of those guys, one person can say, say, they are going to live with this. Grace gave me ice cream. It tasted like feet. <laughs> Thank you for watching the seven second challenge. I hope you had as much of a good time as our contestants did. Five teachers, five prompts, only one chance to win. The challenge, create an unforgettable drawing from the mystery prompts and face the wrath of a professional art teacher. This skit is in no way endorsed by Mrs. Mooney or the art community. It is meant to be satirical and it is in no way filmed to scare off learners that have not had Mrs. Mooney. This message has not been approved by Miss Mooney, even though she is in it. Hi, welcome back to Sharpen. In today's episode, we're with Mr. Kenna. <laughs> Mr. Volker. <laughs> Miss Hostiger. Hello. Miss Gibson. Mr. Porcio.
Hi. Okay, you're gonna take one out and then you will have five minutes to do a drop. Miss Mooney, which would be our judge for the drawing contest. Okay, Miss Mooney, here we have drawings from our facilitators, and you will have to criticize them. This is the first one. I would say this person needs to start over. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, I mean, Poor Mr. Porzio. That was yours. I, I traced it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this is the next drawing. I like it says, that Sheriff and High Strawberry Bird. <laughs> Oh, this will go into the first grade category. Oh, oh that's pretty good. Yeah. That one was Mr. So Volker. Volkers. Beautiful. Yeah, amazing. Another masterpiece. Mine's so much better. No, it is not. No, it is not. Um, zero for plagiarism. I think this person can probably only draw stick figures. Oh! That was me in a kitchen! That's my little frog with a backpack. He's got, there's a water bottle in his backpack. Is that Gupta? Oh, oh, it's a frog! It's a frog! Oh, and not a turtle. Here we have another one. Is that supposed to be me? <laughs> oh, oh my gosh, she guessed it! It's <laughs> me! Oh, hey, you know that. Oh, look, it has a little sun. <laughs> yeah. With a sunshade. So this is your third grade award. So yeah, can <laughs> For the last one. Great. That's awesome. I like the way that they have the wings in the background and they've got the, the kind of like the Van Gogh kind of swirlies in the background. Van Gogh! That's the winner! Miss Dr. Yeah. 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 Two hours left. When did we learn this? Gotta focus. Only two hours left. I'm five questions in. Man, I just opened that way too loud. Everybody's thinking about it. I need to cough again so bad. <coughs> I can't focus here. <coughs> Luke, sit down. You're being disruptive. Yes, sir. You know, Gabe, roasting marshmallows on the heater was a really good idea. Thanks, Luke. What do you mean, thanks? It was my idea. What? 